it's go time. Here's what to expect when you make your first delivery with Amazon Flex. You should be at the station by the time the block starts, although you may arrive up to 15 minutes early. If you arrive more than five minutes late, the app will not allow you to deliver and it will be considered a missed block. If your plans change and you can no longer deliver a block, make sure to cancel at least 45 minutes before the block starts. If you accepted a block that starts within 45 minutes, you have five minutes to cancel. Otherwise, these will be considered missed blocks. We understand there may be times when you have to miss a block unexpectedly. However, too many missed blocks could impact your eligibility to deliver with Amazon Flex. If you accepted an instant offer, remember that you are committing to deliver those orders right away. Your delivery may start at a variety of locations, including delivery stations, stores, and waiting areas. Be sure to bring your current driver's license to each block. Only a state-issued official driver's license is accepted. If you do not have a valid driver's license with you, you will not be able to pick up packages and it will count as a missed block. When you arrive at the pickup location, the app will provide information on how to pick up orders. Sometimes, delivery blocks can have a lot of packages, so it helps to make room for them ahead of time. When you're done picking up the orders, it's time to hit the road. The app is key to making deliveries, so it's a good idea to start with a fully charged phone and a charger. In the app's main menu, you can select Today's Itinerary to view your entire itinerary and plan your route. Tap on any of the map markers to get more details about each stop. While your device is in navigation mode, you can swipe up from the bottom of the screen to check for notes from the customer and access codes. The app will also let you know if a recipient must be present for the delivery. If a recipient does not have to be present, be sure to leave the delivery in a safe location, out of view of the street and protected from the weather. Some packages may be fragile, so please handle all packages with care. Customers expect you to be respectful and professional, including around their property. It's a good idea to maintain a safe distance between your vehicle and parked cars, mailboxes, lawns, and garage doors. Don't enter a private home or garage to deliver a package, even if the door is open or the customer asks or provides notes requesting inside delivery. Also, remember that it is illegal to put a package in a mailbox as those are reserved for the postal service. Some orders may contain alcohol. You can only deliver alcohol to customers who are at least 21 years old, provide a valid photo ID, and aren't visibly intoxicated. You must check that the recipient's ID matches the recipient, scan it in the app, and collect a signature. If, on a rare occasion, you are unable to scan the ID, the app will prompt you to collect the information manually. Please ensure that all manually entered information is correct. Your Amazon Flex program eligibility may be impacted if you do not follow this process. Delivery partners should attempt to deliver every package, but sometimes you may not be able to. If you can't get to the delivery location, or if a package is missing, damaged, or rejected by the customer, use the help menu in the app to report it. Be sure to choose the correct reason when you make your selection. Bring back all undelivered packages to where you picked them up. Please note, outside of highly unprofessional, illegal, or unsafe behavior, a single failure to meet delivery service requirements won't affect your eligibility for Amazon Flex, but repeated failures could. If you have any questions about Amazon's delivery requirements, feel free to check the app's help section. Thanks for delivering with Amazon Flex.